السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته in 1991 I was supposed to be submitting my thesis my MD thesis to the medical school before November at that time and I was very busy trying to finish uh, the editing and correcting the references in the thesis in 1991 actually in uh, April 24th of April 1991 there was a big cyclone in Bangladesh where actually uh, the water was actually covering more than 25 million people under water in Bangladesh at that time. So it was big, big news at that time for all of us. And I was between uh, the you know, struggle of raising funds for Bangladesh at that time, as well as submitting my thesis before November on the same year. What I have decided to do is to send my family home for a holiday to Cairo, to Egypt, and this was actually in end of June, beginning of July, uh, to go there actually to spend the whole uh, three months or two months of summer holiday in Cairo and while I was finishing my uh, thesis before its submission before November the same year. Uh, at that time, I had a phone call from young people two young people from Bradford who raised an uh, amount of 30,000 pounds and 30,000 pounds at that time was a huge amount of money for Islamic Relief. And they told us also the two first class tickets to be given to us to go to Pakistan, to go to Bangladesh to spend the money there and so on. I was hoping to find someone from the young generation, younger generation in the Islamic circle or in the mosque in Birmingham to try to go on my behalf because I couldn't be able to travel because of my actually uh, being busy uh, trying to rewrite the thesis again. But I failed. So on one of the Fridays before we traveled, I decided to drop uh, my thesis and prioritize the suffering, the, the traveling to uh, Bangladesh. On the same day, which was Friday, I went to my desk in the medical school and was writing something and Allah guided me to write a new hypothesis or a new theory about the disease which I was trying to work on, try to what 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 causing such a disease called spina bifida uh, as well. So I wrote the new hypothesis in the evening, it was 6 or 7 or 8 o'clock in the evening, and on Monday morning I went to the, uh, the medical school and just maternity hospital to my boss there, and I was writing it in red. I showed him, uh, Dr. Ian Rushton, I showed him the writing of the hypothesis and said this is very good, put it as a new hypothesis to help in explaining how this problem happened. Then I went to Bangladesh for the two weeks with my colleague from Bradford and my colleague was there but of course we went to see all the project direction project the uh, net for uh, fishing project actually the mini tractor project uh, and others as well and other mini farms and all these sort of things be done by the local community in Bangladesh because they are very shrewd and very active and very intelligent of course during the time I had uh, attack of flu and diarrhea and I was in bed for about three to four days before I recovered again. The message here for the young people like yourself listening to me is actually when you prioritize the priority of the community and the priority of the cause of Allah to your priority, Allah will never let you down at all. And on the day that I decided not to go and not to carry on doing my own work for my thesis, Allah let me to discover something which I've already written, the data at the time, I had this data for five or six years, but I never discovered the relationship of my new hypothesis and the disease till I decided to go to Bangladesh and prioritizing it and leave my thesis behind. Please, please, please give priority to the community. Allah will raise your profile high in this life and in this life to come. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.